she might be wondering, Danielle, why so many zucchinis? Or, Danielle, that's a lot of squash. What are you doing? So why am I growing so many squash and zucchini and all of that? Well, why not? I have the space, why not? That's the first answer. The second answer is if they survive and they make it and I don't lose any of them and I'm able to harvest off of all of them, that will provide a whole lot of food. But um, I plan on taking all of it and um, dehydrating it and then turning it into a powder or a flour, if you will. Um, actually right before this I did a little bit of research because I was curious because I don't I don't have celiacs or anything like that so I don't need to be gluten free but um, this is just my long term plan because it's something we can grow and produce here ourselves that isn't going to cost us very much and I can de dehydrate it and then grind it up into a fine powder and then we have a flour source um, and I can put that in long term storage um, now if I was actually going to use it and like put it into practice, I would like, I don't know, for example, say there was a flour shortage or something, um, I would take what I had on hand for flour and I would mix it, do like, try to do like a 50-50. And the reason I would do that was for, would be for texture. Um, I just think it would be better, but it's also a good way to stretch out your flour there. If you're somebody who is really cautious, especially for all the people right now who are pinching pennies and trying to find ways to save money, it'd be a really good way to produce your own flour and then mix it down with regular flour. So you'd still have a little bit of store-bought, but you could cut that cost if you needed to. Um, so yeah, that was just something that I'm doing that I wanted to share, and you could do it too. So, But I'll mostly do that with the zucchini. Squash has a little more flavor. You could still do it with squash, but it does have a little more flavor, so you'd want to be kind of conscious of what you were cooking with that. Just my thoughts. Thought I would share. All right. Check out all this plantain just to grow in my yard. There's a bunch of it here. Yep. I'm gonna grab a bunch today and dehydrate it. Cause it looks great. Oh my gosh, you guys. Check this out. Do you see that garlic coming back? Do you see this little baby here? I do not regret moving the garlic out of the bag and over there at all because look at that. It's coming back. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Yay.